Hello guys, my name is Arun and welcome to my channel. <coughs> this series is a series of tutorials on LaTeX programming. Now, in today's tutorial, we'll be looking at uh, report classes. And now, as per the name suggests, we'll be writing reports and we will look at how to write reports using uh, LaTeX. Okay. Now, to start with, to write report, you just need the document class report. As simple as that. And other than that, uh, other than this change, everything else that you done that you have done in uh, article in article class and letter classes, they just apply more or less exactly. Okay. Now, if you want to start uh, writing the report class, what you can do is that go to the wizard on the top of your tech maker, then uh, click quick start, and in the quick start, okay, you just set all these options as per your choice: the title, the Babel lang the Babel package language. AMS packages, geometry, graphics and all and the one thing you have to keep in mind is that when you go to the document class instead of article set it to report and that's about it and once you've done click OK and once you do that all these contents that appear over here will, will, get, will be generated by your tech maker automatically other, other than that it's not a big deal since I already have it I'm not going to click OK <coughs> that's about it now once <coughs> this is once this is done okay let's see how to start with now uh, now there is actually a small big small difference between <coughs> an article and a report now in a report class accepts chapters whereas article class do not accept chapters when you saw in the article class, there, uh, if you want to make divisions in the document, okay, in article class, we use the option called as section, subsections, sub subsections, okay. But in article class, if you try and make a chapter out of it, it won't, it will not be possible because the article class is, you know, it's an article. You don't have chapters in an article. It's just an explanation, literal, uh, as the names are su suggest. As a said, report. This can be big and it can have chapters because a report by its literal meaning uh, allows chapters to be a part of it. So uh, reports accepts chapters. So other than the sections, uh, subsection and sub subsection options which we followed, uh, which were available in LaTeX, sorry, which are available in the article class, report classes accepts chapters as well. Okay, now let's start with it. Now to start with the chapter, what you have to do is you just have to type this follow this content let me just paste it for you that's about it you just write a chapter is to start a chapter using this backslash chapter command and inside this command okay you just write the chapter name now uh, I just want to be a little funny over here so I just start, uh, starting with the chapter I'm just writing a chapter called as vegetarians just for a joke okay don't take it seriously anybody I'm a vegetarian by the way <laughs> just for a joke okay now this is will be chapter name and if you want to have a section under this uh, vegetate under this chapter just write section and then try uh, start writing your contents so now if i put it over here now the first chapter is vegetarian and it has a section called as intro that will be the section name and it will start writing contents so if i were to save this uh, build this okay and now if you look at the table of contents it's empty because it is empty if I run this again okay now there you have it the table of contents is start right it start filling up it says that you have one and it's vegetarian and it's in, it's on page number two and then intro starts with page number two again now if you look at this if you look at the main contents into it the document the report has one chapter and it's named number as chapter one and the chapter name is vegetarians as we mentioned in the chapter title and then afterwards the section and uh, section is named as intro and then all the things we wrote, we wrote under this section uh, they just start filling up and they, uh, and they just start filling up now one interesting thing you have to keep in mind here is that uh, in article classes the sections will be numbered just one two like that no point something nothing like that whereas in articles sorry I mean that's an article whereas in reports the chapter name okay the numbering system goes like chapter name chapter number section number subsection number and sub subsection number so you have four four values to describe the sections 
any any particular individual parts whereas in uh, articles you just have only three levels like sections section name section number subsection number sub subsection number like that you have three levels over there so so you have to keep in mind that sections will be numbered with 1.1 like chapter number and then section number like that okay that's about that and if you want to have a subsection just go on with it and just write it so and then if you write subsections like this and there you have it if you look at the top uh, you have uh, you have the chapter number okay, let me zoom it up for you yeah the chapter number section subsection like that suppose if you want to have a subsection in your report it's quite it's easy as well so what you can do is it just write sub subsection as we mentioned over here cut it I just paste it up over here run it run it okay let me zo just zoom it out for you the sub subsections do not get numbered but they do get appear but they do appear in the table of contents so if I just run it again um, come on okay I guess the sub subsections do not get numbered nicely I guess let's see now anyway anyway moving on like if you want to write mul another section and stuff and if you want to just continue with the same format as we looked above you can just proceed with that and let me cut all this and paste it over here I'm just including two or three more sections into it now let me build this up and zoom zoom out a bit and there you have it this is your first chapter and your first chapter has three sections one two and three and your first section has uh, one subsection and that subsection has one sub subsection like that so when you uh, build it twice okay and if you zoom in zoom in to look at your kind of table of contents the chapter the chapter uh, the section and your subsection gets numbered but your whereas your sub subsection does not get numbered at least in this format that is does not get numbered but either way it's not a problem it just works out fine okay that's the one that's one thing and next okay okay fine uh, you can ask me hey Aaron that's fine I just wrote one chapter what if I want to write another chapter it's simple as that just write just like how you wrote chapter to begin another chapter just write another chapter like this and proceed further so so what I'm going to do I just wrote another similar chapter like called as chapter vegans again just for a joke okay which has its own sec which has a lot of sections subsections sub subsections and everything and a lot of that and just let me just copy all that okay cut it and cut it and let me paste to the bottom okay and now if I were to build this okay I build it twice and there you have it your chapter one is over and then after this you have an intentional line page break you have an intentional page break and that take and the new chapter begins in a separate page and, you, and your this chapter is named as chapter two and it's named as vegan so, so if you look at the table of contents they are just renamed they just named in the, the topic the values get named it properly the contents get named I mean the main part, part of the document gets numbered properly that's about it and let's say if you want to include few more chapters like this you can just go on and uh, okay I've included two more chapters like one more chapter like this okay now this chapter is about vegetarians people who just who eat vegetarian as well as egg but they just avoid uh, uh, meat any form of meat other than eggs okay uh, just don't uh, this is just for a sake of example guys so, so don't take don't take whatever I say over here very seriously except the technical part don't take into the content part very seriously but take the technical part seriously okay uh, if I run this if I run this so chapter 3 is vegetarians and they just pop up nicely and after running twice if I go look at the table of contents just goes on fine now my qu now here's a here's the thing what if I just uh, okay I just want this chapter vegetarians to be on the first and vegetarian chapter on the second can't I do that it's possible what I'll do is that uh, just copy co copy all this content just cut this content and you just want since you just wanted this on the top of chapter vegetarian okay 
go to the place where your chapter vegetarian is present and then paste it over there paste it over there and then build this twice and there you have it so you have the chapter vegetarians to be first and then your chapter vegetarians and then your chapter vegans so if you go to the table of contents as well it's rearranged accordingly now how simple is that